Kieran, congratulations on halfway. going halfway across oh, the Atlantic. The <laughs> just we have that. To. <laughs> Cheers. Mmm, yummy, yummy. Woo! Uh. <laughs> 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 Whoa! Ooh, it really. <laughs> I think that the chocolates in our advent calendar are melting. They're pretty much like soup right now. You know? That's so sad. Yeah. Well, tomorrow. Oh no. It's gone. <laughs> it's like it's like soup. There's your soup kinder. Tropics, baby. I think we'll be halfway at 9 o'clock tonight. Oh, cool. Well, regardless, we can be halfway at 9 o'clock at night. <laughs> oh. Or we can celebrate at 6 o'clock if we want. That's crazy. From now on, we'll be closer to the Caribbean than to Europe. I mean, we're actually quite far away from Europe. But how was breakfast? That was really good, thanks. The bread was good. The bread is so dense. Yeah, it's super dense. I'm not sure how you fluffy that up. I don't know either. Bilge is dry as a stone. Are all stones dry? If it hasn't rained. Are not. there beers in this one? No. Uh, no. The small one? Yes. It just fit perfect in there. I know. You can put a few. I'm just kind of one, unless you want one. Yeah, maybe I want one for the coming days. Like I got those for this trip. Look at that guys, we have literally seen no boats for days. The last boat that we saw was I think the day after we left Mindelo and we were on a collision course with. So literally we haven't seen any boats since that moment. Now look at that, we are in the middle of the Atlantic. Plenty of room! Coming right for us. Closest point of contact, 0 0.4. Oh, maybe he's turning, maybe he's turning. What was it before? 0 0.16. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah, he turned. No, I don't, I don't know, I think it's... You know what I mean? Like, this is too close for comfort. Here's how I think about it. When there is a boat that I'm a little unsure of, I calculate the time that it would take us to take down our sails and turn the engine on and be able to turn to avoid collision. And with our setup, it's actually a long time. Yeah, but we could reef this in in five minutes, probably less. Yeah, but like, you don't want to be stressing up until the very last moment, right? Did we ever have foul weather gear on? No, not. Like, really. I had the jacket out one night. Yeah. And I used it as a blanket. Oh, really? Much. 
Huh? No, I, I never use it. I think maybe I used my my Heli Hansen jacket, but that's it. We used the blanket. Yeah. Yay! Hello world. That'll keep it a little cooler, I think. This taker ship's like just slowing down. So like they were doing five, now they're doing two. Do you think that maybe they're having a little halfway party on their own, you know, and they're like, ah, maybe we shouldn't operate the boat right now, maybe we should stop. Maybe they're swimming! Got it. You see it? Yeah, I do see it. Just barely on the horizon. It's a big ship, I mean, it's 300 and some feet. Yeah, what's our closest point of approach now? Ma mile? In 52 minutes. Yeah, they slow down. They've altered course pretty drastically now. Oh really? Maybe they saw us. And maybe it took them time to turn. Yeah, because before the boat was like this. Coming across our bow. Yeah. And now it's like parallel. To us. Okay. Creative ways to fight boredom. Where do we start? Just anywhere. We're gonna start with the ships. Pretty good. You look like a like like an eighties gangster. <laughs> or like, no, like like an eighties wannabe. Oh, that's good. No, take it all off. I don't give me a hit <laughs> Now there's our first, I think, sight of a squall, a true squall. We're at just ahead of us, but it's ahead of us, so it's not really... So we're not going to see it, no, actually. No, so everything's moving like this way. It's party time! Okay, so for our party, Ryan, we have Grog. No, we're going to have a small, a small quantity of Grog. Oh, gross. Just a, li so gross. a little bit of Grog. To celebrate. I feel like I've just vomited in my mouth. Halfway. <laughs> just a little bit. A tiny drop. A tiny drop. You know, it's like to mark the passage of the halfway mark. There's no tradition with grog. Yes, now there is. I'm no. making one. How many times have we passed halfway across the Atlantic? Five. You're lying. This is the first time that we're halfway across the Atlantic, so we're making the tradition to have a little sip of grog. Jules would approve. I don't think so. Yes, he would. I don't think so. Anyways, what else? Okay, then we have... We can have beers. Yeah. <laughs> Do you want a beer? No, I want my... Uh, you want the Rattler. Yeah. That's not alcoholic. Yeah. Great. Tonight you're the driver. That's fine. And I was planning on making a cake. Well, you know, you well maybe I make the cake tomorrow. Yeah, maybe. For Christmas. All right, well, we're gonna do that then. Oh, and of course, party party attire is required. What's that? Mm. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Oh, actual beer. Mm. Special occasion. Okay. 1,030 some. Oh, so we're actually not quite. We're, we're actually halfway, 20 nautical miles. Close enough. It will be in the middle of the night. Which is exactly in four hours. Which is yeah. I will be on watch. Yeah. So you'll probably get to. Okay, Ryan. This is our halfway party. Let's talk about what you've learned 
on the first half of this trip. I've learned that the world has a lot of water. A lot of water. I've learned that I have a patience problem because this is very slow. And I've learned that I'm really going to enjoy the workout when we arrive. But there's a lot of water in the world. Deep thoughts by Ryan. And I think that we're going to get some rain tonight. Wow, that's also deep. I have learned that it doesn't matter if you're 20 nautical miles offshore or right in the middle of the Atlantic, it looks the exact same. Yeah. Literally nothing changes. No, I've learned that this is actually a lot more fun than I thought it would be. I think the next couple days will go fairly fast, but then I think once we get past quarter, three quarter way, it's gonna, there'll be a couple days that are really slow. Second to last day, I think will be very slow. You think? Last day will be fast. I don't know. I mean, now it's been what? It's the longest passage that you and I have done. It's actually a lot better than I thought it would be. The pa passage? Yeah, I thought that we would be exhausted and... But we were exhausted uh, until yeah, just a couple days ago. Yeah, in the beginning. But that's because the sea state was unusually shaky. Yeah, if you want to let yourself be bored, I'm sure that there are plenty of occasions to be bored but listen to a lot of podcasts, read some books, I spent five hours today doing my nails because I can and I have literally nothing else to do and then yeah, it's fine, it works. But yeah that was only a week. Eight days. Seven weeks. Eight eight days. Oh you should tell our community about our almost pirate attack today. What? You know? The one that you invented because you're so bored that you now have to make stories in your mind. I'm telling you, they were gonna attack us. <laughs> okay, Ryan. And now, to the most important part of the halfway ceremony. Oh, uh, I really don't want this. A little sip. Uh, for just, tradition. Just, it has to be the smallest you can possibly pour. I, I it will. Because this stuff is gross. Don't... It's, it's not gross, it just tastes like moonshine. It's tradition. It's... okay. New tradition. It's tradition. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> little, 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 little. Okay. See, that's very, that's little. very little. Okay. It's great! Alright. Okay, Ryan. Congratulations on... Halfway. Going halfway across oh, the Atlantic. Just that. Cheers. Mmm. Yummy, yummy. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I hate that. Woo! Another little Whoa! Ooh, it really. Whew. It's hard. It really sanitizes your intestines. You can feel it going down it's all the way. Bad. Whew. The power of the grog. I'll rinse it with a little bit of moxie. I can't believe a week ago we left. Like it was hard getting out of that harbor, but I remember the first night it wasn't so bad on the boat. Remember yeah, we put right. these walls up and like it was okay. It was fairly windy. It was blowing hard. It was a little windy, but we had the we had the sails reefed in a little, and it was okay. That's true. We were making good speed. The five first days were really tough. They were. It was like the it was like second, third, fourth days. This. I think that for the last forty eight hours, it's been really pleasant. It's been alright, yeah. It's like we can function on the boat the same way that we function at Anchorage. It's a pudding, I think. How do you know? Because I think I saw it earlier. I went to great length, Ryan, to prepare this pudding. <laughs> In the plastic? <laughs> oh, 
okay. Oh. Oh, wow. Ooh. I don't know if I'm gonna like this. No? Do I smell? Well, first of all, it looks like poop. It does. Like, like poop, yes. No, I, I don't think I'm gonna like that either. <laughs> Oh no! Grab little spoons, we'll try. Should we eat out of the same plate? Yeah. I don't I don't like the smell of it. No me neither. Okay. 